Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Apps Portals Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduke, and this is tip number 97. The power of account scope entity permissions. In tip number 66, I described the different options for entity permission scope. Two of the options, account and contact, are similar, and at first glance, it might even seem that the account scope option is redundant, since you can replicate the same permissions using contact scope and parent scope entity permissions. In this tip, I'll explain why account scope is still very useful. While it's true that you can replicate the functionality of account scope using a combination of contact scope and parent scope entity permissions, the major difference is the underlying fetch XML that is generated with these two options. While they will be equivalent from a permissions perspective, the generated fetch XML with account scope will include fewer link entity nodes which might be a lifesaver if you're running into the limits that I described in tip number 92. As an example, let's look at the fetch XML generated when querying for a table that is related to the account table, where one account can be related to many rows of this other table. First, we'll set up an account scope entity permission for that table. Looking at the resultant fetch XML, we see that it has no link entity nodes. Next, let's set up a contact scope entity permission that goes to account, and then a parent scope entity permission from account to our custom table. The resultant fetch XML has two link entity nodes, even though the same permission scheme is being enforced. Using the account scope gives the portal code the hint it needs to simplify the query. Of course, if you're not near the limit of 10 link entity nodes, then feel free to use either approach but the day may come when you add a few more permissions and you'll wish you had used account scope instead. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Apps Portal's tip number 97 on the power of account scope entity permissions useful.